day number 55. Um, I've just come from a colonic and oh my golly gosh, I feel so much lighter, so much clearer, so much better. Um, I was getting them weekly for the first month and then I've just started to get them fortnightly. So this I think has been my second or third fortnight and my goodness, just noticing how um, much stress accumulates in the body, how much, you know, when we, when I don't, so normally what I've been doing is getting something each week. So w because I've had the colonics fortnightly, I've also been getting in between then a kinesiology session or a chiropractic session and these usually alternate and I don't think I had anything last week and I haven't had anything this week either um, anyway it's been a while and so as a result there's also been so much happening in terms of um, work and um, assessments with uh, university and as a result <laughs> The accumulated um, energy in my body from what's been moving through me as well, because I've also just been on coconut water. I'm just about to break my 16 day, which would have been 17 days today, coconut water fast with watermelon, which I'm super excited about. But just noticing how much stuff gathers in the body from the collective our environment what we're going through uh this week as i said with everything it's been really intense in terms of workload so that's just all been accumulating in my system and oh my gosh i just feel so much more clear um after the colonic so much more clearer um yeah, so I'm, that feels really good. So I'm going back to weekly. In terms of my energy levels and where I've been at being 16 days on coconut water, it's actually been phenomenal. Like this journey has been nothing like I anticipated. I thought I'd just be all on juice. I feel like I've been on juice forever, you know. I didn't expect to be on coconut water. There was a point there where I was having some honey um, over the past maybe two days uh just because that's what my body was craving however i was informed that um by the woman that i'm working with um noah that honey is fungus um associated so that's been interesting however i've still been having it just to kind of like move me through and now i feel yeah i've just had so much energy um to the point where today was probably the the day just with all of the external stresses that i've woken up and actually that I've that I've slept in you know and I slept in normally I'm up at about five anywhere between 4 30 to 5 30. Today I slept in until 6 30 so and I let myself sleep until 6 30. Um, yeah so noticing myself become even more sensitive to stuff around me prior to getting my colonic today I was just so hungry for, not hungry, um, having these desires for food to the point where I would save reels and um, recipes of reels, uh, reels of recipes of how to make beautiful food on Instagram or Facebook. And coming out of my colonic after clearing everything, I don't feel that at all anymore, <laughs> which is wild. So, yeah, I feel like this could be my lifestyle. That's actually how it feels. So, that's super fascinating. I have been craving savory. Noah recommended that I also have some tomato juice, which feels really exciting. I didn't even, exciting, I, exciting. I didn't even think about having tomato juice. And as soon as she said it, I was like, oh, my taste buds were like, oh. Yes, please. Yes, please. Yes, please. Um, yeah, other than that, 
I've felt so fantastic, so on top of everything. Um, and also like I, yeah, can just handle so much more stuff in a way that I have been able to in the past, but it hasn't been through this means. So this feels fantastic. There we go, 36 days to go, 36 days, 35 days to go. There we go. <laughs>